Team Incredible. Ballet! I didn't think we'd get that far, you know. We've, we've, you don't, no. you never know how America is gonna gonna view that dance, and I feel ballet is often um, misinterpreted. Uh, yeah, misinterpreted uh, because it doesn't read as much as contemporary does. I feel, for example, when you do a solo or something, because almost the emotion is within the technique. Yeah, and you put so much into that, but obviously for for show purposes, um, some people might not appreciate as much, but. I, I feel like it's it's ballet's really gotten a strong voice this season and people are really opening we up. We love to you, it. Daniel. Yeah. That's the only person we're missing in Team Ballet. But no, I completely I'm like gonna piggyback on him. I completely agree. I think it's a style that Koala Bear. Koala Bear. I think it's a I think what? I think it's a um a style that hasn't got its voice spoken yet. And we're so grateful to still be here and to represent, but um, hopefully it inspires others to take it up because it is it is hard, but it's really a beautiful style, and you feel pretty doing it. And when you when you get that pirouette right, or when you get that devil pay with the hip down, like you feel accomplished. You walk home and I'm like, okay, just look yeah, good just, today. It's so much so much work and so many years that go into it, trying to make it look effortless. So just now having come this far and being able to have like opened up with the show and getting new dance style is a really rewarding feeling you know uh, but um yeah love it i love it love it oh, i love it <laughs> shut up <laughs> <laughs> we're getting silly we're, we're getting delirious oh my god we're so tired um actually um Yes and no. I, I didn't have a solo prepared until last night and I just kind of made something up. And I wanted to do a superhero solo and uh, just didn't get the chance to clear the music, but I might bring that next week. But um, yeah, it was definitely like I, I wanted to be kind of like a fighter and Cole helped me a little bit. I helped him with his and we always work together in the studio. So that was fun. Keon is just... Keon is my inspiration for this next solo. It's a beautiful inspiration. It's just beautiful. been it's been a it's been a struggle between the two of us this past season. Uh, but no, <laughs> in reality, I don't know yet. I I will be real. I don't have one prepared, so I'm just gonna kind of see She'll what. Come out in a pink tutu during the sugar plum fairy. <laughs> I will see what. <laughs> I will see uh, what. What I feel this week, what emotion is predo predominant, and what I feel, and hopefully um, choreograph around that. All right. Well, it was today's funny, embarrassing moment. Today. In general. Uh, yeah. During Sonia's this morning, my whole crotch area just ripped what? apart, open, exposed. No, like he's like peekaboo. <laughs> <laughs> it was so bad. But you mean in general, since this the week. beginning, this or week. just this week? This week. Hmm. Yeah. Trying to, like, it wasn't me. Like it, other people did embarrassing thing. There was definitely someone who like farted during rehearsal. I was just, like majorly embarrassing. You too. I did. I did. You did. Yeah. Well, I was in the corner. Awkward. You did. Yeah. Okay. She, at least she admits it. It's cool, you know. I smelt it away. That's all that matters. <laughs> That's all that matters. <laughs> um, I don't know. What, what else was embarrassing? Uh, he bit my butt. In a but lift. That was funny. But that was just funny. That was funny. That was funny. <laughs> Imagine you farted that. <laughs> <laughs> we we did this press lift and her bum's right here and I used to like always bite it. She'd be like, ah. <laughs> Freak out. <laughs> That's what happened this week. Thank you so much for the update. Thank you so much.